Good morning, Daddy. What up, what up, what up? So D back with another one. And today I got this beautiful neck and back massager. Woof. I mean, by the brand of Comfier. That is the model number right here. So you know you got the exact same one if you try to purchase this. I'm going to do an unboxing and a little small review. And you know how I do. If you have any questions in the future, holla at your boy. Now, I got this because after I got into the car accident, my body's just been jacked. You know what I mean? Beat up. Especially my back. And um, I wanted something that would be, you know what I mean, more reliable than someone massaging you. Because, you know... Massages with hands is way better than any machine can reproduce, but I'm going to give this a try. And I need something that's, you know, always consistent that I can use and have the time. Working at night, it's a hell of a job. And coming home, tired, most people's not up. So trying to get a back massage is real complicated. To the point, though. Uh, turn this around. All right, so we have um, different things on this massage. Massage your neck, your back, has bolsters, the air compression on the side, and also down here on your thigh. This is what the remote looks like. These are the options. So that's situ, rolling, air massage and spot all right so let's get this thing open uh, work on one hand one hand on him one hand on him. i'm the man on him. one hand on him. Oh, man all right so we in here all right let's move that this is massage in here. All right, excuse one hand. Mm. Mm. There we go. Let's see what else is in here. Got a little box here. Make sure it's charging. That's just nothing but cushion. All right, so let's move that. All right, so what's inside this? So that's the brick powered up. Pretty big brick here. Plug. All right. Now let's open this baby right here. All right. So nice little fabric here zipper pretty sure you can take it off to wash it and this is the main cloth here put this back on all right down here we got the instructions get rid of that then we got a covering here so those i have the back massager i'll show you the old one but um Really didn't have this padding here. And this is good for those that have, um, you know, sensitive backs or whatever. Or the situ is um, too hard on your back. You could put this down for extra padding. I'm pretty sure you could take this off because you're supposed to be able to wash it. Yep. So, if you don't want the padding, if you're a big dude like me and they got a lot of muscles in your back, this would be better. Because this would probably be too soft for me. Here's the bolster sides that inflate with air compression. Now here's the seat. Got the bolsters on the side too. And where do they tuck the remote? It's a little wire right here. I'm pretty sure that plugs in. Yeah, that plugs into there like that. Okay. Got a pocket down here. Let's see, no zip. Or oh, backwards zipper, so that means don't touch. It's a backward zipper right here, so we ain't gonna mess with that. 
and the remote. Woo, I like that. See, my other one had the remote on the seat part. They put the remote up here. So here's the remote. It's pretty dope. Got the power on and everything. All right, so let's set this thing on up. Set it in my chair where I'm going to have it. I appreciate y'all watching. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. You know what I mean? Please like and subscribe if you like what you see here. Any questions, you know, holla at your boy. Now, this is my old one right here. So, like I said, it didn't have the padding and everything. The remote goes in this little pocket right here, which is kind of annoying. Nothing in the seat, nothing special with the seat. Now, this is the new baby sitting in my gaming chair. As you can see, the pattern is like way different. And I removed that cover. So, and you can even see like the rollers, they sit up top and set it down below. But I don't know if that's going to be the normal reset. I don't know if that's because of the coming the, um, straight from the manufacturer. So, we're going to check it out. I'm going to try it out, see how it feels. And I'm going to let you know. So let's play around with the settings a little bit. We're going to power it on. All right. As soon as you hit the power, it seems like the options are already set for you. That's pretty dope. Pulses are filling up. Air compression. Pretty dope, like that. Air intensity. Ah, squeeze a little tighter. There you go. Now let's put the seat on. See the seats moving. Let's get the neck working now. Neck working right. Boom. We got some vibration. Level two vibration. So this whole control is lit up basically. Except for auto and rolling. Let me see, you can hit rolling. So it seems like it's rolling down. Vibration sounds good. I'm gonna hit vibration three. Turn it all off. All right, so I'm about to sit in this thing right now. <laughs> Let me test it out. Be right back. All right, I'm 6'4", 280 pounds. Uh, see how this thing works out. Nice. Make that neck. Vibration on here, level one. So the vibration is coming from the seat on level one. Level two is coming from the seat still. So I guess the vibration motors is just only in the seat part. But it feels good. It feels real good. Now again, this ain't better than somebody else rubbing you, but you know what I mean if you can't have that all the time. If you ain't got the money to go, you know what I mean, to the spa or something like that. If you don't have someone, you know, in your household to rub you like that, this is this is pretty good so far. Alright. Now I'm gonna try rolling. Oh, that feels 
feels good. And I also got heat. This thing got heat too. So I'm going to put the heat on real quick, even though I'm hot. Can't put on the AC while I'm making the video. Put on the bolsters. Oh yeah, oh, that feels good. Put on the seat bolsters now. Mm. Yeah, this is this is this is pretty dope. Woo! It's getting that spot right there. Oh man. Now this device was about two hundred dollars, and I understand if you ain't got no money like that. You know what I mean? It took me a while to even get it myself. You know what I mean? But so far, it seems like it's worth it. Longevity, I don't know. You know what I mean? The material looks good. I I didn't get inside of it, so I don't know if the composite components look, but um. Yeah, this thing look, feels good. It's strong enough. Like I said, I'm 280 pounds. I don't feel like it's having a hard time moving up and down the rails. The bolsters are really pinching me and I'm just confining my body, squeezing me. The neck massage feels good. I'm kind of tall, so it's not leveled all the way on my neck. It's like at the bottom. But that's what most of the pressure is for most people. It's like right there on your shoulders almost, on your neck. So it feels good. And then I can lay my neck back if I want to and get more into it. Feels good. The rollers don't go all the way up because I'm tall. It does go up to about... Um, almost close to the top of my back but stops on like a, a couple inches um, from my shoulders so if you're tall those are going to be your problem like I said before I'm 6'4 so I'm kind of lengthy but overall first impressions I like it it's a hundred times better than the, my old one more features, stronger um, rolling balls, Shih Tzu. Yeah, feels good. Now the problem I had with my other one is that it turned off at a certain time, like 10 minutes, and I had to restart it over and over. And when it when it stopped, it turned off. So I'm gonna see how, how long this one lasts, how long this one goes for. And when it does stop, what do it do? Do it turn off or does it ask me for my next option? But I ain't gonna do that on video because I know it's gonna be a little boring. So, if you have any questions, you holler at your boy. I got some videos coming up soon. You know what I mean? It's COVID. It's damaging a lot of things, but I'm trying to make it through. Like and subscribe, and I'll let y'all later, man. Woo, easy.